guys, welcome back to the lived experience. Today is all about our first experience flying with Rwanda Air from South Africa to Rwanda and then to Tanzania. We headed out of Oral Tambo to Kigali International Airport on the 20th of June. The flight was supposed to depart at 3.10 a.m. and it was slightly delayed, so we did head out about 45 minutes later. It was only a short four-hour flight. Upon boarding, we got our seats and got comfortable with small pillows and blankets which we had to hand back. For economy class, the seats were nice and plump, surprisingly. We were served with a meal, juice, water and it was a really smooth flight. Our second flight, now from Kigali, Rwanda to Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, was on time this time and departed at 10.50 a.m. on the 24th of June. Hi. Hello. What's your name? Edgar. And what? Edgar. Edgar. Yes, uh. We were also served a light meal and refreshments. This was a five-hour flight with a stop in Kilimanjaro where we sat tight while others disembarked. We also used Rwand Air for our flight back to Johannesburg, which was pleasant. So a few things we really enjoyed. It was surprisingly comfortable and the food was fresh. If you guys know and you've ever flown international, you would know that the scrambled eggs on any flight are really horrible. But we did have an amazing omelette and it was really, really enough for our tummies. The ticket prices are really competitive and booking online is way cheaper than doing it over the counter. And just so you guys know, Rwanda also flies to a few other destinations other than Rwanda and Dar es Salaam. And these include Cape Town, South Africa, Mumbai, India, Mombasa and Nairobi, Kenya, and Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, and many, many more. So next time you book your flight, make sure to compare the different prices on various airlines. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. But until next time, Murakoze, everyone. Ah, that's in Ah, that's in